Hey, Parks, uh, what's it like being one of the floating dead? It's quite peaceful, actually. Quiet, no noise or distractions. Certainly no violence, no wars or fighting of any kind. Frankly, it's boring the phlegm off me. I hate it! I want a new clone body! Ah! <laughs> I almost feel sorry for the poor guy. Almost. Now would be a good time to tell me about that ace up your sleeve you mentioned. Octopus loins I'd almost forgotten! Crypto, you're a genius! Using Pox Lab, I've created a new virus that will infect and kill the Blisk. Catchy. Let's hope so. I've arranged for it to be delivered to the moon by a new courier company. Oh, What's the name? The North American Shipping Association. Anyway, everyone calls them NASA. You wouldn't believe the cost of shipping to developing galaxies. I should mention, though, there have been some... Uh, complications. Give me the scoop on this virus. Uh, it's been a while since I had a flu shot. Super Retrovirus OMGWTF. It attacks the Blisk on a molecular level, causing spontaneous cellular combustion. Poof! No more Blisk. Okay, I'll buy. What kind of complications? The delivery men are refusing to land without clearance from their boss. A fellow called Houston. They're just hovering there waiting for orders. And let me guess, we're gonna give them those orders, right? Exactly. Yeah, I'm a regular rich little. Okay, let's get contagious. I'm being sick and tired of scientists bitching and moaning. Comm tower is being down, signal is being too... Thank you. 
Those scientists are turning off the communication towers. If all of them are active, we won't be able to send a strong enough signal. Crack those aim and get those towers up and running.
protect that land, or we're all doomed! Doomed for sure! There'll be no escape. Oops, wrong game! That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. That's it? What? One small step for man, one giant leap for mankind? Seven months and that's the best you could come up with? But you didn't like it? No, I didn't like it. It's crap! Where'd you find it? On a cereal box? I thought it sounded profound. Profound? You wouldn't know profound if it hit you over the head with a Camus novel. You think Merv Griffin's a deep thinker. Listen, mister, I'm getting a little tired of your lip. Oh, yeah, Commander Big Shot? What are you gonna do about it? Pull the plug on this mission, that's what. Sorry, Houston, but I can't work another second with this jackass. Get in the car, get in the car! Moron. Goldie! Oh, am I glad to see you! You won't believe it! The Bliss Guard! Planning to kill humanity and turn Earth into an irradiated water world? I know. Oh, well, uh, uh, the good news is Pox has... Concocted a virus which will cause the Bliss to spontaneously combust? I know. Oh, how'd you know? I'm a spy. It's what I do. Okay, well... Uh, so, what are we gonna do? We're going to bring these Flawlachi to their knees, that's what. 
I'll release the virus. You just keep those Krebbies off me while I do it. They're not touching a hair on your pretty little head, Dollface. Trust me. They'd better not. I told you, I'm allergic to shellfish. But one way or another, Tovarish, this base is coming down hard. I am so turned on right now. I gotta ask you, Nat. How do you get into that suit? Shoehorns and Vaseline, baby. Rawr. If that's a pickup line, we're a match made in heaven. So what do we know about this Blisk base, exactly? We know it's split into two domed sections, and it's swarming with Blisk warriors. Very unfriendly. Also, the entire base is organic, alive, and much of it radioactive. Uh, well... Guess if it was easy, everybody be doing it, huh? Hey, it's only the fate of our species, right? We can do this. I'm ready. Are you ready? Da, comrade. I'm ready. And spaceman? Good hunting. Rock and roll! Boy, honey! Hurry, Crypto. We haven't got much time, and we need to find a way through. Where the hell are you, Crypto? This is a two-man operation! Get back here! I am curious, Yellow. on the bad end.
They're everywhere! I had five brothers, Crypto. I know how to get you back. Onward and upward! 
Australia has some nasty medicine for you. You're wasting your You're going to get yourself shot if you're not careful. Crypto with a weapon this time. I know that one. Who's there? This shouldn't take long. Probe, although I bet that's an issue. See if you can find a way to turn off those jets. 
Crypto, you'll have to find a way to overload the gas generator. Maybe I hit rock. This is all we need. Do me a favor and take care of those crypto. <laughs> Let me do this. You like to get a close load up. Not one up with me, Captain. Sure did, Dollface. We saved the Earth. We killed the Blisk. I am pleased to have helped you vanquish your foes. Hey, you know, after a while, that big blue mud ball starts to grow on you. I mean, at first you think it's a boil, but... It's all right, Crypto. You don't have to pretend. I know how you feel about humans. Well, not all. Natalia! You're gonna pay for that, you son of a bitch!
calls recharging unit is his armor. Take out those blades and he'll become vulnerable. And also, naked. Brace yourself for the horn. Crypto, I've been ringing you for hours. What in the galaxy is going on out there? 
Sorry, Poxy. Uh, just working on a little science project. Wait till it do. You're finally showing an interest. I knew one day you'd make an excellent scientist if only you were properly motivated. What is it? Physics? Biology? Little of both. A little of... Wait a minute. I'm detecting residual heat from the cloning lab. Crypto! You did it! Listen, you little pustule. If anyone's getting a new clone around here, it had better be me! Who was that? Kriptushka. Telemarketer. Nothing to worry your sexy little head about. Whatever you say, my insatiable alien loves her. Wake me up when you're ready for re-entry. I made a few adjustments. <laughs> <laughs> 